Welcome to Soyuz video number four, the SU-019 FET microphone. Let's begin with our machinist, Roman, as he cuts discs out of polycarbonate material. Like many rockets and missiles, the SU-019 uses a stacked disc system for its internal structure. Once the polycarbonate discs have been machined, they are sent to our drilling station, where a series of holes are drilled through them using a special template. One by one, brass pins are then forced through the holes. For the electronics of the SU-019, we chose to use a system known as wire wrap. Although not the fastest or easiest technique, wire wrap is exceedingly dependable, so much so it was used for the Apollo guidance computer and other critical aerospace applications. Wire wrap creates a strong and stable signal path. The capsule in the SU-019 is the same handmade K67 style capsule that we use in our flagship SU-017. For the transformer, we buy custom toroidal cores and wind them ourselves. This creates a unique and very musical transformer. Every part of the SU-019 and its shock mount is machined and painted in our facility, giving us total control over quality. Like all Soyuz microphones, the SU-019 comes with a small card signed by the person who assembled it. After a final series of tests and quality checks, the SU-019 and its shock mount are carefully packed for shipping. After one final check, the box is sealed up and one more SU-019 heads off into the world.